like, be thou and thine. And it's hard to process that much old at one time. Those words were way cool, back half a millennium. But now it's a pain just to try understanding them. So we ran the script through the Script Squash 250. It's the machine that makes old scripts more nifty. It tightens the plot, which is kind of gigantic. The whole play rhymes now, and it seems kind of iambic. <laughs> but there might be a minuscule thing to confess. It could sound a little bit Dr. Seuss-esque. Not that we're trying to do that. Come on! This play was insane before Seuss came along. Besides, if we wanted this play to seem Seuss-like, would we have this Shakespeare brigade on Trick Moose site? <laughs> <laughs> Amazon dove, for you to observe my strength. My strength and my might is why we are having this bumbling fight. What? Is that all? Okay, quit. Ha! So I win. Now you must admit, this bumbling dueling has solved our disputes. Admit that you love me. Well, you're kind of cute. Did you get that? Yes, sir. Sweet love's declaration. Her answer is yes. I accept your affection. Now let's plan our wedding, our sweet nuptial day. Our wedding? Of course. He's rich. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and you're rich, yes, with daughter in tow, and these two guys love her. Just thought you should know. Euthesius, Aegeus, how are you? <laughs> Enraged. Oh, bummer. <laughs> I'm happy, <laughs> and I'm engaged. Congratulations. Now back to my Keeley. I call for justice. Oh, not again. Really? Yes, Hermia, <laughs> here my own precious daughter is fully in love. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. <laughs> Her heart has been lit like a love firecracker. By whom? By Lysander. I. No. <laughs> Quiet, you slacker. <laughs> Lysander and Hermia, is all this true? Yes. yes. <laughs> what a coinkydink. I'm in love too. In love with an Amazon. There she is. Hi. <laughs> We're having a wedding. That's not the right guy. Huh? Lysander is not the man with my consent. That they should be lovers, I hope you'll prevent. Demetrius here is the one that I picked, but she will not love him. I suppose because I'm strict. <laughs> the law says a daughter must happily wed who her father picks, or else become dead. <laughs> He's got a point there, young Hermia lassie. It's marry Demetrius, or things get messy. <laughs> but I love Lysander. <laughs> <laughs> I know you do, hon. But you'll have to dump him or become a nun. A nun? That's the first option. Option two is worse. I'll give you a hint. You go home in a hearse. <laughs> <laughs> now so that you can break up. Come on, everybody. Let's go plan my wedding. We'll need some activities. Come of war! Sledding! <laughs> Hermia. This close. I know. Don't lose hope. What else can I do? Come with me and hello. Hello? To my aunt's house, because she's filthy rich. She looks far away, and there we'll get hitched. But the law. It won't touch us. We'll be out of range. She lives in a legal undoing exchange. It undoes the laws that are mostly half-witted and makes them less dumb so that they'll be permitted. That sounds fantastic! Yeah, nothing but good. Meet me tomorrow night in the dark woods. You mean by the place where we were by the what's it? Yes, a few steps from the whatchamacallit. We'll kiss her twice. And then we'll burn rubber. The auntie's house under forest dark cover. <laughs> Helena, we have a secret to say. 
to linger in the woods by the female linger? Yes! That will be our next time rendezvous point. From there, we'll be hoping it's out of this joint. Wish us good luck, friend. Hell enough, adieu. As you don't on him, may Big D don't on you. <laughs> Very juicy. 
jam. The jam that I like with my Sprite toast and ham. That jam was expensive. It came from Madrid. It's just like you to take it. I know that you did. <laughs> I don't deny it. I have your preserves. But no, you cannot have them. It's what you deserve. <laughs> <laughs> on to obey me. And you said you would love me more than anything, but the way that you love that jam is just like a sin. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so just try now enjoying your toast and your sausage. I know that you won't because I have that jam hostage. <laughs> <laughs> so my girls and I came here to dance in the meadow. yourself to a stupor. No, we're the party. Look at you, the pooper. <laughs> and you can sit here and continue in that. We will find a new place to do our dance at. creature they see when they wake, be it a cow, or a rat, or a snake. I'll serve Titania a helping like butter, then laugh when I see who she picks as a lover. Now hurry up, Puckster, bring that herb to me. I'll circle the globe in 12 seconds, point three, we hit pow! <laughs> Excellent. What? Who's this causing such trouble? I'll just listen in, because I'm invisible. I do not love you! Please call me, baby! <laughs> Perhaps not love yet! Just say it! Say, baby! You told me that Hermie is here in the woods! That rascal Lysander! They're up to no good! But I cannot find them, nor see where they hide! So I'm stuck out here with you by my side! <laughs> you are a flesh flowing man of sorts! The closer and closer with every retort! The more your harsh words are rebuffed and attack me! Or your love magnet works to attract me. I do not want to attract you! Buzz off! I am your puppy in spite of your scoffs. For me to look at you makes me want to spew. <laughs> oh. I want to spew when I can't look at you! <laughs> I'm running to hide from you in the wush bushes. The animals there have extremely large dishes. <laughs> They sit on their prey till their prey dies of boredom. True, they can be bribed, but most folks can't afford them. Now I have some money and you have no cash, so unless you want to be whoosh bush tush smash, do not follow me. Turn and run back. I love you, Demetrius. Cut you some slack. A change for those two is what cooks in my eye. Tonight in the woods, he will beg for her love. Boom! <laughs> Don't do that! <laughs> Did you get the flower? I got stuck in rush hour, uh, but here's the flower. You said corduroy, right? Don't mess with me. Get in, queen! <laughs> get it right. Here, you take half. I've got more work for you. There's a girl in the woods who is blue. She loves a man who will not love her back. 
Squirt this in his eyes. Get his heart back on track. Make sure that she is the first thing he sees. His heart will burn for her 10,000 degrees. <laughs> How will I know him? His clothes are from Athens. Ugh, those mere mortals have no sense for fashion. I'd rather dress naked than wear what they wear. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for that image. <laughs> now get out of here. Don't mess this up. Hey, it's me, King. I'm on it. I'll draw such a love picture you'll wish you'd have drawn it. Go! Okay. <laughs> so Titania came in and slept with the shrub, and Oberon slipped her the musty love drug. When you awake, you'll meet your own heart's delight. Call it revenge for our love spat tonight. <laughs> then come the running lovebirds to the stage. My sister got lost, and they can't find their way. Uh, Lysander, I pooped. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're sending me here. Let's take a rest. Thank you. That would be easier. <laughs>
is B. Without your love, I can't survive. <laughs> but hark, what's that sound? Something went quack. <laughs> I'll go check it out. You wait here. I'll be back. <laughs> Here she comes, and guess who's behind her? The guy I drugged the first time. Is he behind her? 
Can I give it to her? Well, I would say yes. He's kissing the ribbons that hang from her dress. <laughs> when Demetrius finds her, we'll laugh at all three. Ah, what fools these mortals be! <laughs> a little baby! No, you are my friend, and don't call me baby. I will till the end. But Hermia! Ah, what a tedious girl. I've wasted my time with her. She makes me hurl. Oh. Wait, is it my <laughs> Myself. They got stuck in my stash. You know, my stash, you mock me, you're teasing. No, kissing your ribbons is really quite pleasing. <laughs> I wish you'd let me kiss your lips one time, hon. Look at that face! It eclipses the sun. Demetrius? Helen, a baby, so fair. Did you call me baby? What's going on here? <laughs> Mine, 
and novices here, but we've got the training, and that's why we're here. We've spread this fall play with Blue Buffalo Cleaner. For other plays, that'd be a gross misdemeanor. But not for this play. Because we're on the job. What? Can we help in Seuss cleaning snobs? No writer's style is as clever as his was. And nothing removes it as nicely as this does. We've tried other cleaners, but they had to go. Nothing gets out Seuss like juice of Blue Buffalo. <laughs> That's why this play flows just like the wind blows. We clean it right up. But we don't do windows. <laughs> Titania and Bottom were more than befriended. She now loved a man who's a whole head of you. <laughs> Over on five to see how she reacted. In this dating game, poor Titania was losing. Just thought he'd remind you, in case you were snoozing. <laughs> oh, Bottom, I love you. For you are the handsomest. Your head is awesome. It's hip to the maximus. <laughs> Snappy, but I need to power down for a quick nappy. Well, sleep all you want, my tushy stud muffin, because I'm sleepy too. What'd you say? Oh, um, I think. <laughs> and so the two slept, and away that was sleepy. But King Oberon said, This is just a bit creepy. <laughs> <laughs> hey there, young puck. We make a good team. Ha, I punched that guy good. Yeah, and I punked the queen. It's time that her dignity was reinstated. She will no longer be infatuated with this foul beast, this whoosh bush tush man. <laughs> I'm even with her now, and I got my jam. So Oberon woke up his queen with the flower, the one made of tweet with all that love power. He then showed the queen who her lover had been. Are you kidding me? I did not love him. special to wake up ground sleepers. People! What was that? Just ask them! Jeepers! Why are you sleeping outside here today? Hermia and I were running away. Off with their hands! <laughs> That's your daughter. <laughs> that doesn't matter. She's got a fair sister. I'm not sure, I just know what to say. But my love for Hermia has melted away. Now I love Helena. Isn't that weird? I think that's great! This is just as I feared. <laughs> I'm in love too, with this girl Amazon. Say hi to the people. Hi, people. Rock on. <laughs> We're getting married today. Yeah, we know. You love birds, you get ready to go. Clean yourselves up, this is your lucky day. You couples will also be married today. But, sir, A and G, come get married too. Ah, well, it's been a while. Come find if I do. <laughs> so all of them went into town to get wet. As Bob was still getting used to his head, he ran to find all his pals in the wood. Hey, guys, I'm OK. <laughs> and our play is good. All of them cheered. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Meet me in town at Duthesia's place. <laughs> the players had 
store. Well, I have a monkey who swings from trapezes while painting landscapes on six different easels. A straw man who balances table trunk trees while he plays a xylophone from overseas. Two cooks in a cook-off on poetry ferrets and a non-speaking, non-limiting parrot. I tell you, these choices was worse for my throat. What? Is that all? These just don't float my boats. <laughs> Is the acting poor? No, the story's just sad. And yes, the acting is bad. <laughs> well, I'm in the mood for a bad acted play. How about the rest of you? seen that guy's audition. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen such a well-spoken partition. <laughs> oh, oh yes, here comes Pyramus on his love mission. He comes to the wall. This will be great. Yeah, let's listen. <laughs> should shout back at him. Uh, <laughs> actually, no. How grim is this piece Q? Soon she will enter, and then I will view her through the hole in the wall here. In fact, oh, here she comes. Pardon me. I must act. <laughs>
Come run away with your pyramus, elf. Who? <laughs> I thought this was somebody else. <laughs> no, this is Pyramus. Couldn't you tell? Well, I thought it was Ricky. <laughs> or maybe Montana. <laughs> or Harry, or Gary, or Harry, or Bennett. Or Tony, or Tony, Maloney. I get it! <laughs> <laughs> of this vile wall. should have waited, I'd say. Yes, the partition has just run away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not so sure Thisbee's digging her man. But it seems like she's got a few more in the can. <laughs> <laughs> now just so you ladies don't get scared and run, our lion is fake. He's, He's not a real lion. <laughs> no, he looks real. His costume's advanced. But most people like to watch plays in dry pads. <laughs> Here comes the lion. And Thisbe's in store. Will he attack her? I hope he won't. <laughs> oh, the night is dark. But I hope to see my one, my only, faithful, Thisbe. <laughs> <gasps> but what do I see? Thisbe's scarf. It was good, but now it's all tattered and stained with her blood. <laughs> oh, tragic lion, why do you exist? My girlfriend and I didn't share one last kiss. I must have weird one at the wall tonight, Callie. <laughs> You're still picking rocks and hair out of my mouth. <laughs> Ouch, trusty bomboloon! Take my and wound the chest of Pyramus! 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 <laughs> Where is heart to pound? And so I die like this, 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 this! <laughs>
most all of us. He's now a fairy TV show psychologist. <laughs> Play in protestness! Ah! 
Thank you. Bye. Bye.